Demonstrators marched to a prison in Pretoria on Wednesday to protest the imminently expected release of the man who killed South African anti-apartheid leader Chris Harney. In 1993, Janusz Walusz, who had emigrated from Poland before becoming involved in far-right politics, shot Harney at point-blank range outside his home. It was a murder that sent shockwaves through the nation. Last week, 69-year-old Volush was granted parole, having served nearly 30 years of a life sentence. He should not come out. Protester Nantokozo Shazi said Volush should not be freed. He's not South African, but he wants to go home. Who is he? He can't kill our leader and then thinks he can go home. That should not happen. Hani was head of the South African Communist Party at the time of his death. He was also a senior member of the now ruling African National Congress alongside Nelson Mandela. On Wednesday, a smaller group of protesters gathered outside South Africa's parliament in Cape Town. Among them, one of Mandela's grandsons, Mandela Mandela. People that have brought about extreme pain, scars to our victory of the struggle for liberation, are supposed to be locked up for life and are kept in jail for life. On Tuesday, authorities said Volush had been stabbed by an inmate. The Department of Correctional Services said he was stable and receiving treatment.